Hi, this is Carol Shields, and this is my life. Born in Chicago, Illinois, on February 10th, 1928. Unforgettable. AKA Nana. AKA Nana. <laughs> I spent the first 20 years of my life in Chicago in the same house. I was born upstairs in the front bedroom. Mother didn't even go to the hospital to have me. And uh, I had a great life there. Has someone We had a lot of fun with the neighbor neighbor children and I love to climb trees. There's probably a picture there you can see of me in my favorite cherry tree riding, um, riding my bicycle. I spent a lot of time on my bicycle and I look back and think if my mother knew how far I ventured from home in that big city of Chicago she would have probably had a heart attack. We had it pretty nice. It was being that I was born in, the, in 1928, uh, my youngest years were during the Depression, and we didn't think that we uh, were deprived of anything. We had food on the table, Dad had a good job. And Unforgettable in every way, and forevermore. I think I was around 13 or 14, and I started doing some modeling down like at Marshall Fields downtown in, in Chicago, and then some photographic modeling later, some newspaper advertising. It, um, even back then, they had color pictures in the newspaper, and uh, there were, and um, uh, some of those pictures might be some where I was singing. I started taking singing lessons when I was, I think, 15. Uh, I was uh, one of five children, had two wonderful parents, mom and dad. Mother came from uh, Durban, Michigan, and uh, dad came from Chicago. Mother lived uh, her early years in Durban, and dad and she met in Chicago and were married there. You were content to let me shine. I had uh, an older sister and uh, two older brothers and one younger brother. So I was the one with all the glory While you were the one with all the strength A beautiful face without a On November the 20th, 1948, I married Bill. And um, 
Karen was born um, two years later. Preceding, I was happier, felt better than I ever had, and just um, looked forward to her birth like, like um, nothing that I've ever looked forward to. It was the greatest, greatest day of my life. She, you know, for quite a few years, it was just she and me. Um, it was just the two of us, and uh, we even had a song called You and Me Against the World. Um, she was studying to be a teacher. She was student teaching um, when we moved out to Arizona. It, she was just fun. Um, she's a good mom, a very caring mother. Um, one of the most talented people I've ever known, and that's purely objective. She can paint, play the piano. She started playing the piano when she was four years old. Um, she can sing. She has a beautiful voice. She has a voice like an angel. And uh, she just uh, always made me laugh. Claude Shields in uh, Tucson, Arizona. My mother and father and I and Karen were on a, on a, on a trip. We had just come out to Tucson and we were staying in a, in a, at the Spanish Trail. And um, I had been divorced from Bill for, oh, probably uh, six months, I think five or six months. And there was this nice man swimming in the pool. The weather was beautiful. It was February and cold and icy back in uh, Illinois. And I started swimming with him and she said, Mommy, I want you to meet my friend Claude. <laughs> I thought, what? <laughs> And so he, he, he was kind of over by the pool, and apparently, you know, she had met him before I did. So she introduced me to my future husband. I didn't know it at the time, because we didn't get married until 1961. He raised me and was a wonderful, wonderful man. 